It's not surprising that a lot of people might not even realise that the European elections are just around the corner, given the choice ordinary people are usually faced with. Successive Tory and New Labour governments have shown what they're all about and who they really represent. The EU and the European Parliament offers another opportunity for the mainstream parties to vote for cuts, privatisation and EU directives which erode the rights and conditions of working people. And that is why on June 4th, No to EU, Yes to Democracy is determined to offer an alternative to the parties who represent bankers and big business before they represent workers, students and the poorest in society. No to EU offers that alternative. We're an alliance of trade unionists, of political parties and of community campaigners who stand against the bosses of EU, against the attacks on our rights, our pay and our pensions and against the attempts to make ordinary people pay the bill for the bankers' mistakes. Well, I am supporting no to EU, yes to democracy, because, because although I think uh, I support the European Union itself, I think the European Union uh, is just uh, going on a way that is not supporting, it's just supporting the big, big businesses. In Medway, EU directives which have been voted for by mainstream political parties are contributed to the closure of this post office. As more cuts in our services and more people out of work. And now the government plans to use new EU health directives to cut further cut back and privatise the NHS. Across Europe, we've seen attempts to roll back workers' pay, conditions and living standards. Well, the main reason I'm supporting no, no to EU Yes to Democracy is because I have grave concerns over the Lisbon Treaty and what it's actually going to do to the workers. At the moment there's nobody out there that really represents the working man at the cold face. And now, with the recession being used as to legitimise mass unemployment, it's clear why trade unionists, socialists and community campaigners are standing in this election. We want to see workers protected from this recession, not thrown on the scrap heap. We want to see uh, decent free education for young people with training and a decent job at the end of it. Not £30,000 worth of debt and no job at the end of it. We reject the Lisbon Treaty and the notorious EU gravy train. In June 2009, there will be a real alternative. The pro-big business parties and the lies of the far right. No to EU will be standing candidates across Britain and if you want to see an end to undemocratic EU directives and would like to see bankers rather than workers pay for their crisis, lend us your vote on June the 4th.